Do you really? Yeah. No, I'm serious. Mm -hmm. I tell you, one day somebody's going to say, you had the class and you had Mr. Johnson and Ms. Jackson and Ms. Scott and Mr. Turner and Ms. And you had uh, uh, Ms. There you are, Ms. Irving, and you had, uh, wait a minute. And, and Ms. Irvin, and you have Ms. Thompson, and Ms. Chambers, and Ms. Zacharias, and you didn't act right with them, did you? Well, I was upset. <laughs> it's on me, right? I ain't gonna have that. If you send me somewhere, it's gonna be because I did something. Right? <laughs> but I'm gonna take care of that. It's best I know how. I guess I'm the assistant. Y'all can work alone. So this is freeze dried, so I shouldn't have any problem, but it's because it's freeze dried, but it still has some embalming fluid in it, which is this embalming fluid. Um, like I said, it's two percent formaldehyde. It's ten percent formaldehyde. Now understand that you have blood vessels associated with this heart, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now, you know, I have a friend that when he teaches anatomy, he uses large cow hearts, and after he finishes with, with dissecting the cow hearts, then, because of the way his lab is made, they cook it. <laughs> no, people eat, people eat cow hearts, they eat cheap. Yeah, I, mean, they I mean, the cow tongue I understand. They eat hard. Right, so I'm going, you do what, man? Oh, yeah, they just love it. I say, I don't need to get their attention like that. Mm -hmm. Now, basically, these are blood vessels. These are not man-made holes. But the point is, you can't really determine these because until you actually dissect the heart. Okay, so we're going to see this, this get this straight. Yes, ma'am, the heart and the kidneys and other organs are encased. What kind of tissue is that? Connective tissue. <gasps> Oh, oh. Do it again. Stuff <laughs> <laughs> is connective tissue. That means the connective tissue supports and protects, right? Right. Mm -hmm. So that's what it's for. Too much could be a problem. You know where you're cutting, or you're just guessing? He's about to I'm just, I'm just saying, I know he's done this quite a bit of time, but. But you have to give it to him. Oh, you're cutting it in half. Yes, this is a sagittal section. Open our heart. I hope, <laughs> I hope it won't squirt on our faces. I'm just There's saying. There's nothing in here. Why would I do that? It's I'm not going to let you sit in front of me and say, okay, I'm going to get you. <laughs> That's not how it works, you know? <laughs> You did that on purpose. No, yeah, I did, but no, it's nothing in here. Well, if I it's like blood, your taste. It's, it's kind of like mine, but you're just better. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Come on. This is a dull blade, dark brown. Like this, I'm packing it. What? Now this is on so YouTube, what? so you can readily yeah, see this. Right. Right. So I'm doing this so just to get your attention. Is this a human heart? <laughs> what is that game? Race it just. Oh, I picked it up home. last night. I got some of those kids. <laughs> they took their hearts out. No, you did not. Just say but that. But you gotta understand now. Ever since the beginning of time, what they've been doing to children. Dissecting them, eating them, yeah, yeah. Stuff, everything, no raping them, them. yeah, right. Mm -hmm. What did they do during World War II? They shipped up, put all those children on the ship, sent them somewhere. Right, yeah. correct. All right, so if you look without me finishing this, okay, That's I'm the getting left. ready to finish. What's the left? Let me see. No, just you're not going to use this. You're going to use this no. instrument. This is a, I just had it. This is what you use. I'll let you have these, but these are mine. I've taken them with me. Yes, have These are called probes. This is a blood probe because you want to tear up the tissue. 
Now I'm cutting through the bowels and the tissue now. And then you'll be able to actually observe the interior of the heart. See how tough it is? So miss that that I have. What, what, where is the left side of the heart? Like Ms. Zacharias, what's the left side of the heart? This, side. this is the left side of the heart. This is the interventricular septum between. Here, the way the heart is cut, this is the right ventricle. The right atrium is up here. This is the right ventricle. See that dark material in there? It's not gonna squirt on you, but this is dried blood. See? Oh. Now, let's see if it done it. Kind of stinks. You smell from out there. Wow. This valve, this blood vessel leads from the, if I'm not mistaken, Now you can see it really well. You see this? And when you look, you can see the valve. So above the valve is the right atrium. And if I asked you, Ms. Chambers, what Sorry. blood vessel enters the right atrium, you're gonna tell me the superior and inferior vena cava enter the right atrium, right? The blood goes through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle. But you won't have able, able to visualize, understand this, but from the right ventricle, the heart is pumped into, I get the valve to show up, and the blood vessel, and it's somewhere. There. Like too much fat around it. No, it's right. This is the right. There it is. You see, this is a valve. So the valve, this blood vessel is coming from the right ventricle, right? Mm -hmm. Where does the blood from the right ventricle go? It's up there. I put it up there on purpose. You see this? Come over here, girl, so you can see what I'm doing. Come on over here. Where's Mr. Turner? I don't see him. Matthew. Is he in here? Matthew. Matthew. You see what I'm doing? Yeah. The blood vessel that leaves the right ventricle goes where? To the pulmonary trunk. Thank you. From the pulmonary trunk to the lungs. Thank you. Now, this is what ventricle? Left ventricle, you know that because of this thick mm -hmm. myocardium. Thick myocardium. Mm -hmm. This is muscle. Now, this is the valve. Right here. So, you know that this must be the left atrium here that leads to the pulmonary veins. If you look on this side, you can see the rest of that valve where the oxygenated blood enters the left ventricle. From the left ventricle, this is the blood vessel, so where is it? This is the aorta. Mm -hmm. Where does it go? The aorta goes to upper circulation and lower circulation system. Y'all can play with this for a minute, wrap it up, and put it away, please. Yes, sir. And we need to finish the lecture for the day. But what you're looking at is you observe these parts on the heart. This is what you compare the heart that you observe. Okay? You're looking for the ventricles, the valves, the right and left atrium, etc. Did you get the inside of it? Did you get the inside of it? The pig is still coming. 